I'm Jackie Ritter, and I'm an English teacher here at the high school. Hi, I am Julie Korchowski, and I am a social studies teacher here at the high school. We want to thank the board and administration for inviting us here this evening and for supporting uh, the AP Capstone program. And we want to thank Dr. Nugent for seeing the value of the Capstone program and bringing it to Springford. We also want to thank the whole district, uh, faculty and staff here at Springford. Um, endeavoring to implement the Capstone program is quite an undertaking, and we can't do it without the help of a large number of people. We have individuals who had offered their advice as um, experts in fields, as well as sat on our institutional review board and on our student panel for presentations. So the capstone program is a two-year program. Uh, the first year is seminar and the second is research. And even though they are English credits here at Springford, they're very cross-curricular. Our text and our topics um, come from multiple uh, curricular areas. And the students are also given the opportunity to use 21st century skills as a lot of the resources we use are audio and visual uh, pieces. Uh, the first year um, and through the second year, we are focusing on developing critical thinking skills. Um, we begin with those research skills in terms of assessing the quality and credibility of sources. And again, they extend into the 21st century skills as good citizenship, um, watching the news and participating in local and regional government. So the capstone program, um, as we have can see here, uh, the first year is seminar, and in seminar, the students have the opportunity to investigate current issues, and they also have the opportunity to learn the foundational skills of research. In AP research, they shift from those little r research skills to big r research skills. They have the opportunity to become an expert in a field of their choice. So they begin um, really by perusing that academic field and determining what exists in that academic field and then what they can add to that community. From there, they design their own research and fill that gap. So through the capstone program, the students have the opportunity to earn a certificate or a diploma. In order to earn a certificate, students must complete both seminar and research and score a three or above in each course. After earning a certificate, they have the opportunity to go on to earn a capstone diploma. So by taking four additional AP exams and earning a three or higher on each of those exams, they earn the diploma. We also wanted to tell you a little bit about how you earn those AP scores. So it's a two-year program. In the first year when our students are taking AP seminar, there are three components to the AP score. Uh, the first performance task they complete with a team. They choose a real-world problem or issue, and then with two to three other students, they investigate that issue. Each student writes an individual report, and then as a team, they present a possible solution to that problem. In the second performance task, they're given a stimulus by uh, the college board, and they use that as a springboard for developing their own argument and then presenting an individual written, um, or not individual written, individual presentation about that argument. The last portion is more like the traditional AP test where they sit down for an end of course exam. In the second year with research, students will choose a topic and they will fill a gap in that current research. They will conduct their own research, and they will write a four to 5,000 word paper, a research paper going through the entire process from literature review to methodology to conducting the research, discussing their research, and then the students will uh, complete a 20 minute oral defense. So they will defend their research once they are finished. This program from start to finish is incredibly fast paced and incredibly rigorous and for that we wanted to take the opportunity to thank you um, that for uh, availing us of the co-teaching opportunity. We genuinely believe that the individual feedback that students need and the, the mentoring through the, pro the program would not be possible with a single teacher in the room and we see that in the success that our students are achieving and the AP scores that they're earning. So this is the AP Capstone Quest model. 
our kids know the Quest model all too well. Um, but if you take a look at the Quest model, the capstone program is different than other AP courses because it is, because it is not content-based, it is skills, skills based. So the students are taking the opportunity to um, learn those reading, writing, research, communication, and teamwork skills uh, through both years of the program. Um, so when we are looking at the AP seminar course, um, it's per preparing students to move into those upper level undergraduate courses that are very um, discussion based and have um, a great deal of text that they need to get through. And then as we move into AP research, it's actually far more sophisticated. Um, traditionally, students have not approached this level of work until they were in graduate courses. And we know that this is providing our students um, a leg up in the college application process as well as entering into undergraduate research programs um, and increasingly it's becoming being a part of those programs is becoming a necessity to apply into graduate programs All right sorry dr. Nuge was just telling me we're one of well, ten in the state when, when I first started okay. we were one of the first ten. yeah uh, so last year we had our first group finished the program. This is year three, so last year we had our first group who had finished both seminar and research. So we've had 15 students earn AP diplomas, and we've had 10 students earn AP certificates. Some of those certificates will turn into diplomas now because they will earn additional AP credits this year. Um, so we know how interesting and engaging it is to learn more about our classes, our curriculum, and what we're doing at the school level to implement this program. Um, but we believe that the most valuable part of this is what our students take from the classes, the skills they leave with, the lessons they learn, and how this is impacting them as they move forward. And so for that reason, we brought a number of students um, to share their perspective. We have current high school research students we have some of our certificate holders, and then afterwards we even have a couple of videos from college freshmen and their reflections on how it's helping them in their college courses already. So our first student, Casey. <laughs> Hi, my name is Casey Linton. I'm a junior taking AP research. Now, I find that the AP Capstone program develops one of the most important skills that a student could have, and that is the critical thinking skill. Uh, through this program, students are taught essentially how to take a piece of information or look at a text and really understand it and draw conclusions for themselves, which is one of the most important things that a student can do. We are able to analyze information, identify the credibility, value, and the weight of all the evidence and information provided. And this is a skill that is hugely influential in college and uh, careers beyond that. And not only does it give us this critical thinking skills, uh, it also gives us other skills like time management, better cooperation with our peers, and it really does boost our higher collegiate level writing capabilities, because I am essentially writing a college level paper as I am right now. So I'm currently conducting, well, not conducting, but I'm in the beginning stages of conducting a research report on a report on the correlation between political ideology and its and the reception on policy to climate change, depending on its framing and political ties. And now I know I, saw, I said a lot of big words, but <laughs> essentially I'm getting to research what I want to research, which is something that's so important about this course because it really allows students to be engaged in what they value and what they think is significant. And it is significant because we are filling a gap that has never been researched before and we are really cementing our place in this field. Thank you. Hello, my name is Felicity Thatcher, and I'm a senior currently enrolled in AP Research. This two-year class, including seminar and research, has made me feel more confident as I move into my college experience. In my opinion, my writing ability has advanced to a collegiate level, and I have developed research skills that my peers may lack. Although I definitely uh, be taking more than just writing skills to college, this class has taught me time management skills, how to collaborate with peers, public speaking, problem-solving skills, and much more. 
While these classes are extremely useful for later life, they are also extremely difficult. If you're not on top of your work and able to manage your schedule wisely, you will not succeed. The students need to be independent as Capstone does not allow the teachers to tell their opinions on how to make your work better. You need to guide to your own success. Hands down, AP seminar and research are some of the hardest classes I've ever taken in my high school career, but I'm proud to put, on the, I'm proud to put my name on my work when I'm finished. This year in AP research, I'm researching how technology in elementary classrooms are affecting cognition within students. I'm currently finding scholarly sources to give me a better understanding on how to answer this question. So far, my plan is conduct to conduct this research is to go to an elementary class within the Springford Area School District and conduct a survey and an experiment. I'll be surveying teachers that have taught through times with little technology until now and getting their opinions. I will do a three-day experiment where I see t how technology affects the conditions in our own our cognitions in our own elementary school students' classrooms. I feel this is, a, this is important as as technology advances, we need to know how does it affecting our future generations. I would like to thank Springford for pro providing me with these educational experiences. Sorry. It's okay. <laughs> Hello, I am Maggie Zazowski, a current junior in AP Seminar, the second course of the AP Capstone program. I took AP Seminar last year as a sophomore. Throughout the course of AP Seminar, we learned how to use databases we would not know how to use in a normal English class. We received a better understanding on issues around the world, such as discrimination in the workplace, which my group and I researched and did presentation on for the PT1 that KTEL earlier described. And we also gathered methods to check the credibility of a piece of, of literature. AP Seminar was definitely a stressful class. However, without a little bit of stress, we are not being challenged, and a challenge is good for everybody. Looking back at AP Seminar, I am glad I took that class, not only for the introduction of research I received, but also for the group of friends I made. When being in a stressful class, it is always useful to have friends to lean on for help or to be able to bounce ideas off of. As a result, the two-part capstone program is great in the sense that I am with the same group of people this year as I was last year. And we are even closer and can rely more on each other, which is incredibly important when going through the research process. As a whole, AP Seminar was a challenging class, but it had its benefits that I bet will last. As previously stated, I am now in the second part of the AP Capstone program, AP Research. In this class, I plan on exploring the evolution of gender roles or representation based on a specific theory in the Toy Story series. I believe this is important because to avoid children developing stereotypes about gender, equal representation in popular children movies is essential. The hardest part of my research is the trouble of finding scholarly articles within our school's current subscriptions and databases. However, all in all, I am glad I took AP Seminar, and I hope AP Research leaves me with just as much satisfaction. Thank you. Hello, my name is Samira Kiley. I began the cap. I began the capstone program as a sophomore and I'm currently taking AP research. To say that this program has been difficult would be a gross understatement. AP seminar is one of the hardest classes I have taken by a long shot. However, of all the classes I have taken in high school, it has been the most useful. I have used the time management skills it has taught me to balance all aspects of my life. The group work skills I have learned have made themselves useful in my engineering courses as well. The ability to know which sources are credible and weed out unreliable information has come in handy for writing essays for all my other classes. And I'm currently using the public speaking skills to talk to you right now. This class makes you look at the world in a way that most high school students don't. We have investigated everything from the current adolescent mental health crisis to the UN's lack of initiative in tackling climate change. This year in AP Research, I'm investigating if the sexual discrimination and harassment that occurs in engineering workplace and college classrooms also occurs in high school, sorry, high school engineering classes. Without this class, I would never have the opportunity to learn so much about the world outside of our little cocoon of Springford. The capstone program is a hidden gem in the vast amount of courses offered. It pushes you to your mental limits, and as soon as you hit that wall, Mrs. Ritter and Mrs. Korchowski guide you to figure out how to get around and keep expanding. So thank you for giving us the opportunity to be involved in something as valuable as this program. Hi, my name is Olivia Ritter, and I'm currently here a senior here at Springford. I was a part of the AP Capstone program during my sophomore and junior year. 
My research was centered around a high school student's perspective on gun control and school safety in the areas in which they live, being urban, rural, and suburban areas in eastern Pennsylvania. I conducted surveys in six different schools, high schools in these locations and received over a thousand completed surveys to use within my analysis. This program not only taught me valuable research skills and hard work, but I believe it has had a significant impact on the success I've had thus far in the college application process. I used my research as the topic for my college essay, and I currently have four college acceptances, all with scholarships. The whole experience and feeling of accomplishment afterwards was extremely rewarding, and I will continue to recommend this class to anyone within access. Thank you. Good evening, my name is Madison Parker, and I'm currently a senior at the high school, and I took um, seminar as a sophomore in research as a junior. When I was first introduced to AP Seminar and the AP Capstone program as a whole, I was intrigued by its difference from um, a typical English course. And under the instruction of Ms. K Ms. Korchowski and Mrs. Ritter, they taught me how to analyze different works of literature, including modern day news stories from various perspectives, which I actually now use in my international dual credit course under Arcadia, U Ar Arcadia University. In seminar, I also learned the value in having good presentation skills and worth it. Worth work ethic, sorry. These skills were further implemented in AP research, where I conducted a year-long research project looking at feminism in Disney princess films. I was able to analyze previously done research on my topic from various lenses, which were taught during AP seminar. And after evaluating credible sources and conducting my research during a whole year, my skills were put to the test with a final AP research presentation as well as my 25-page long research paper. AP Seminar and Research were the two classes during my high school career that have most significantly expanded my horizons in terms of applying the knowledge I've learned in the classroom to real world situations and I hope to continue this knowledge that I've gained into my college endeavors. Thank you. Good evening. My name is Deepak Kajariwa and I was a part of Spring Forward's first cohort of AP Capstone students. Last year, I took AP research and researched one of my intellectual passions through an, through an investigatory lens. Through AP research, I was able to engage in current scientific literature by studying the relationship between BMI and blood pressure amongst the pediatric high school population. AP research was truly the only course I've taken so far in high school where I can bound boundlessly, boundlessly explore my curiosities and consult with professionals in my field. Last year, I talked to authors of papers I reference and to doctors who are knowledge knowledgeable in my field of interest. Within the next few weeks, I will be submitting my research to a nationally recognized competition, and I'm currently publishing my work to the National High School Journal of Science. Research is something I want to continue doing in college, and without my experience in AP research, I would never have the fundamental skills needed to pursue these future aspirations. I'm immensely grateful for enrolling in this course, and I'm thankful to Ms. Korchowski and Mrs. Ritter who have unfalteringly helped each and every one of us throughout our research quest. Even through the inevitable, overwhelming moments, I'm glad to have undergone this formative educational journey on my pursuit to critically understanding the world around me. Thank you. And we had three graduates send videos back to us. The first video, um, Mahek also sent us um, the feedback from one of her professors for her last paper, so we have that on there also. Out of all the high school classes I took, uh, if I had to pick one that prepared me most for college, I would say it was either seminar or research. Currently in my English class, we're writing papers which require some sort of conducted research and integration of scholarly articles, both skills which I learned through how to do through seminar and research. And because I knew how to do these beforehand, it makes the writing process for me a lot more easier when I write these papers. Also in my engineering design class, I just finished a project on developing a new product for help to help people uh, with air pollution. And without the teamwork and research skills that I learned beforehand, there's no way that this project would have actually been able to be done within the time constraints that we were given. So in the long run, I'm extremely grateful to have taken seminar and research and I will not regret it one bit. Thank you. Hello, my name is Yuba Hamid and I am a freshman at the University of Pennsylvania. In um, my high school years, I took the AP Capstone program offered by Springboard. 
So this consisted of me taking AP seminar my junior year and AP research my senior year. These two classes helped me a lot with where I am now because of the skills that I learned in um, AP seminar and research. More specifically, I learned about different methodologies and other ways to conduct research, which helped me out here like significantly because of how um, this is a very research-based university. So when I have had different interviews, I always bring my research paper with me to show, and it's gotten me a lot of different offers, which is very cool. And also, even in my classes, when we learn about research-based inquiries and stuff, it's all things that I've learned before because of the AP Capstone program. Hi, my name is Sarah Ringenbach, and I'm a freshman at Muhlenberg College and a graduate of the AP Capstone program. The AP Capstone program has prepared me for college more than I imagined it would. Um, I learned a lot of valuable skills that are applicable to doing research, to writing research papers, but also just in college in general. Not only did I learn how to find reputable sources and how to know that they're good sources to use, but I learned how to find sources and put them in conversation and use my own words with other words of other essays and articles and journals. So that's been really key for some of my classes, such as psych and um, my writing intensive class. That's really helped me. Um, one other thing that um, the biggest skill that I have gotten from the AP Capstone program that I've been able to apply outside of research is time management. Um, I thought I had great time management skills before, but I've found that AP research has really AP seminar and AP research have really helped me to know how to pace myself since the due dates are so far apart. And that's something that not a lot of people in college know how to do. And it's it hurts them sometimes. And I'm at an advantage, I believe, because of this program. So thank you, Mrs. Ritter, and thank you, Mrs. Kortowski, for preparing me beyond words for college. Thank you. Um, I just want to thank the ladies. Obviously, uh, another piece I think is important to point out is both of the ladies spent uh, several weeks in training to prepare to teach this course in the summer uh, in Baltimore a couple summers ago. Uh, so just the, t the preparation it took for them to be, be able to prepare for this. We also visited several schools around uh, Pennsylvania, Wilson, I think in Penn Ridge, two schools that had started it prior to us. So I really want to thank the ladies for their preparation and obviously the students for your participation tonight. The research uh, process has also, I think, been enlightening for our staff as a whole because uh, with the review process for research and for the uh, defense presentations, I myself have participated as some of our other administrators and many of our teachers have participated in the defense process. And I think uh, Dr. Roach, I think last year sat in, am I correct, on a defense? So um, anybody, uh, so my point there is that there's a great opportunity for learning uh, beyond just the students that uh, have um, participated in this course. Uh, it's really special course. It is different because it's not content-based like the other APs. Um, so I think it's been of great value, and I say this often, and I'll say it again. When everybody drives by Lewis Road out there every day, past these four walls, what's going on inside is awesome. So I just wanted to share that. And thank you, ladies, and thank you, students. Thank you.